I went to go get a clothes error because like mine is actually broken. I don't know how the hell, but we've had it for like the longest time. So obviously like, you know, it's one of them ones there. And then I obviously, you know, got some girl stuff because I needed that. And then I've come out to Costa, got my free, well, almost free coffee. It's, I got the fudge brownie thingy. I don't know what you want to call it, but yeah, fudge brownie. Um, flavor one and this is uh, well I got it on the app here you got £3.15 on very few Vodafone rewards so I got that much off of my drink you can get like a smaller one or something you know I don't know like a normal mocha or something and I feel really really hot it's not hot outside really thing it's like normal temperature like normal UK you know usual temperature but it's just feeling like that but the rest of the day though I don't know like I cleaned my kitchen last night like a little bit but now like I feel like I need to clean my whole home yeah, it's like my carpet, everything is dirty, like I'm talking about stains and things and food and whatever. I know I can do a bit of a bit of a bit of it's going to be type of thing. Um, after that, I think I might just, you know, I don't know what I'm making for dinner today. I've already had like um, something at home to eat anyway, but I don't know if I can eat from the outside. Because like, do you know what, today, yeah, I was only meant to go get the clothes error for I went to Dunham for it, but the thing is like, was that, do you know what, I'm actually, I can't understand like how expensive everything we've gotten, like, it's actually madness because, uh, you know, before like, you'd be able to get so much stuff here for not that much money, and even before like, you know, yeah, I was going to shop, I'd be like, oh my gosh, yeah, I'll buy that next time, but I never ended up buying because I was like, oh, I've seen it cheaper somewhere else, and that was like, in the past, that's where you've seen it cheaper, it's no longer that place anymore, it's a bit of a mad situation, but yeah, do you know what, I'm not going to lie, I felt a hell of awkward uh, filming in public sometimes, like right now, it's a little bit awkward, but I'm trying to try to keep on filming so that I don't feel that awkward. So, but anyway guys, I'm going to go, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And uh, yeah, get the very new rewards if you have a phone, so you can get it to I bought a light, I bought a, what is it called, like a curtain holder. I bought one more thing, like doorknobs or something, for like a quid. But they were like, I think, not the actual doorknob thingies. But yeah, they had like really, really good offers in here. They even had furniture on sale. They had quite a few things. I think there was a cafe in here as well, but I didn't go, didn't even film it. But look at all these lovely, lovely things. You know what, Dunelm is underrated because they have the most beautiful, looking things and some of this stuff actually looks so so high-end it's actually lovely they had a lot of stuff for like really really good prices in the lighting area i really really wanted to buy like a lot of things but my budget was like nothing i just could not handle the amount of money it would actually take to fund any of these adventures that i wanted to have like look at that that is beautiful i cannot understand how people walk past all of this if they did have the money to not buy it because i love them but the thing is it's like those ones there and they're like you're like oh my god but i've seen it somewhere cheaper and it's like yeah you've seen it in the past there's no way that is what it is today do you get what i'm saying but yeah look at all of this guys like it's so much cheaper than having to buy it in a normal like you know, like a normal price like it's just too expensive like i cannot hands on like what your budget is and how you feel as to what you can afford because i cannot afford any of this but i know it's not as expensive as it could be or as cheap as it could be some of the things were so so cheap i was just like yeah i need to get that but then it was like i don't have the funds for it and there was like some things that were just too expensive like i don't know but even the furniture though guys it was so lovely like they had some nice nice pieces i wanted some new furniture for the house because i have no furniture in my home like literally i don't have that much but i was just like you know what i don't i don't have enough for any any money for it like i've already stressed like you know oh my gosh guys they had like so much like they had everything and anything for everything like you could literally cut your whole home just coming out to this one store you can get anything here and they had like you know like ironing boards they had irons they had what do they have they had bathroom stuff and they had lighting they had like, look at all of these shades over here, though. Look at that. That's beautiful. I love that. Oh, my gosh. And there's such modern ones as well. Like, amazingly modern. And then just over here, like, oh, my gosh. Like, these things over here, yeah. Look at that. Look at the colours on that. That is lovely. That colour there. I love, like, all these pinky types of colours. I am a pink person. Pink is my favourite colour. If pink is not your favourite colour, yeah, don't chat to me no more. Because you don't even have any taste. Look at this oh my gosh look they've got oh my gosh you know what i love frames i'm a sucker for it but look at all those colors like look at that and they've got such lovely textures on them like look at these i just i have no words because it was all so nice but 
you know there was some things were just like stupid and they were just trash but there's a lot of stuff in there that i would think wow and you know you can literally and oh my gosh the stuff in there was super duper nice there was a lady i know i know what everyone says about karen's yeah but there was an actual lady called karen there and she was lovely thank you so much karen for helping us oh my gosh like it was your help is so good and uh i loved this over here this gray one over here was beautiful but again i have no money i can't afford this so we bought like three things and that's it. i even felt bad buying them three things but look like it's so cheap in here like a lot of the items are so cheap but they're such good quality as well like just the just the way everything feels like when you touch it and everything it, it's just it's nice and they've got like oh my gosh guys they've got garden things on sale so that's like the biggest reason we went in anyway because i was just like oh my gosh they've got a sale but yeah and uh, they got all these planters over here i love those they were lovely you know me yeah i look at things for outside and think i could bring that in the house <laughs> like, you know the, the other thing is that you know if you think oh, okay it's for meant for outside it will survive longer inside the home but you know it's those ones there were for something that i'm able to get it because then like you try and look after it and eventually it will smash but it's up to you like I am both, like it depends actually, I think I'm lying over here because I am a bit of both. I am careless, design on the planter, but I love the planter itself, it was just nice. Um, yeah, I've just taken a little, you know, like a little uh, camera shot of the of the prices just in case that is something you guys wanted to have a look at. Just I've put a, a bit of butter, melted it, now you need to grab a little bit of sugar. I always like to use brown sugar in my cookie dough, do you know what I mean? Like, you just need to do that, so I'm going to just put a couple bits of the cookie dough. Oh no, no, I've done too much right now. An egg yolk. Oh, oh no, oh no. We just need a mixy mixy again. All that in there. My turn. So, I, th I don't think we're going to have enough flour for this to be completely honest. Do you know what? I might put cocoa powder in there and stir. Right. I hate baking powder in cooking because it gives it such a disgusting taste. But as I can get with this utensil. Guys, how much shit you're eating. And then when you make it at home, you're like, oh fuck. Like, there's a lot of rubbish in there. And I'm the one eating it all. Like, it's a lot. It's just a lot, right? So then you just want to just mould it to have the rest of our chocolate. Because that's how you get them, you know, them Instagram looking type of cookie doughs. You have to put them all on the top. So you just put them in the top, squash them down type of thing. Oh, the, the dark chocolate is my favourite for like all of these types of things. Right, so that is sorted. Okay, right. So that's sorted. We are now going to go and put this cream on there. But this is the worst ice cream ever. What the hell is this shit? What in the actual freaking hell?